Hi everybody, welcome to Viral Technovations. Today, we're going to go over insane modern-day suspension bridge construction technology. Bridges are a necessity for traveling from point A to B, especially over large bodies of water that makes commuting much quicker. Make sure to watch until the very end, because the process of building this massive structure will amaze you. The development of the Gebze, or Hengatsi, Izmir motorway, was part of Turkey's 315 billion euro injection for huge infrastructure projects. This is key to connecting Gebze, Bursa, Istanbul, and Izmir to maximize their industries. This is the amazing construction of the Osmangatsi Bridge, a suspension bridge that crosses the Izmit Bay. There are many economic benefits for Turkey, due to this bridge being built. Here is the project broken down into sections. Istanbul is able to connect with Izmir via Gebze, because this project connects to the Ankara-Istanbul motorway. Izmit Bay is the most industrialized part of Turkey, which is about 4 kilometers south of Gebze. You will reach Gemlik by continuing along the motorway and pass through the Samanli Tunnel. This tunnel is the lengthiest motorway tunnel in Turkey, at 6 kilometers. The Bursa Ring Road is connected from the motorway, and from there, only about 20 kilometers further, you will reach the newly constructed motorway. You'll pass through other regional towns, like Balakhizer and Manisa, as you go another 300 kilometers, where you will finally reach Izmir. The crowning jewel of this project, the Osman Gatsi Bridge. This is the fourth longest bridge in the world, the second longest in all of Europe, and longest in Turkey, at 1,550 meters long. Different components of the bridge were tested in different parts of the world. Wind and seismic activities were tested in Milano, Italy, decking in Copenhagen, Denmark, the piers in Canada. A multitude of sensors were placed on the bridge that can detect up to nine different types of issues, including asphalt, wear and tear, and displacement. By connecting Bursa and Istanbul, as well as Izmir and Istanbul, it has improved traffic congestion and increased the efficiency of travel, plus boosted the economy from automotive, textile and tourism industries. The net positive financial gain from the project is anywhere between $1 billion and $1.2 billion per year.
the Turkish government was finally able to get this project launched on the third try. The two main reasons that this was finally successful was because the incentives from the government increased the bank ability, and the BOT legal framework was greatly enhanced, and the expertise from the core group of investors, who also specialized in construction. The commercial banks plus strong government support also helped make it happen. the challenge of securing lenders. A diverse group of lenders were able to come together and agree on a common framework. Segments of the project became operational earlier than others, so revenue was able to be generated as the other segments were under construction. In the end, the lenders were consolidated into 8 instead of 21, because the investment cost was decreased along with shorter construction periods. What made this bridge project successful? A creative solution to be able to generate revenue earlier, prior to full completion of the bridge made it possible. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss more videos of today's and tomorrow's technologies and much more. Check out this next video of the top 10 RC cars of 2021 that keeps the fun but eliminates maintenance and I'll see you again soon. Stay curious.